Timmy. Hey, Timmy. Let's play dollies. No, I don't want to. Ow! Shh. Timmy, don't yell. Boo. Don't scare me like that. Are you trying to kill me? Relax. I was just joking. Well, it's not funny. Psst. Hey, Brianna, have you seen my boyfriend Derek anywhere? I haven't seen him all day. No, sorry, I haven't. Help! Help! Someone help! They're after me! They're chasing me! No! Derek, my baby! I'm scared. Who was after Derek? I think there's someone in the building. No one panic. Hello, Brianna. Timmy? I thought you were dead. I came back to haunt you. I came back to haunt you. Come on, scream. Come join me, Brianna. Come join hey, me, Brianna. Brianna, are you seeing scary images? I am. It's not real. Cover your eyes and come with me. What you saw before wasn't real. They're trying to scare us, so we scream. You may see images or people that aren't really there. It's all because they want to eliminate... Oh, no. Your face. It's... It's... I'm sorry. I have to go. Jake, wait. Do I really look that bad? Jake, why did you run away from me? Stay away from me. Stay away from me. Your face. It's scary. Does he really think I'm that ugly? Hi, sweetie. Mom, what are you doing here? Who's at home watching Emily? I wanted to see you. Who are you talking to? My mom. There's no one there. <laughs> Continue being a doll or become a human. I've always wanted to be a human. Oh, honey, you're awake. I just started making breakfast. Here, you should have something to drink. You must be thirsty. Refreshing. Thank you. Um, darling, the water's actually supposed to go in your mouth. Sorry, it's my first day being a human. Brianna, there you are. Brianna? What's a Brianna? Um, you. That's your name. Well, I used to be a doll. Babe, I've missed you so much. Come here. Why would you do that? Because we're boyfriend and girlfriend. That's what we do. Hey, are you actually a doll or were you a doll? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then that means you've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Please, please listen to me. I am not a doll. I am a human, trapped inside a doll. This doll so advanced, you programmed her. I wasn't programmed, I'm human. I need to get out of here. <sighs> <laughs> You're not going to get very far with plastic legs. This doll's kind of weird. Do you think any kids will buy a human trapped in a doll doll? I don't think so, boss. That's not very popular amongst kids. I told you, I am not a doll. Yeah, I don't think she'll sell. If no one buys her by the end of the day, we'll throw her in the garbage. Wow, I want this doll. She looks so realistic. Little girl, I am not a doll. I am a human. You've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Do you know where you used to live when you were a doll? That must be where the real Brianna is. I used to live in a room with lots of other dolls where little kids would come and stare at us. Oh, a toy store. Babe, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Stop it, Jake. That's not the real Brianna. Okay, but it still looks like her. Why does my face feel so warm? Because you're blushing. Now, come on. We have to find out which toy store you're from. You were Brianna's best friend? Not were. I am Brianna's best friend. I've never had a friend before. My eyes are feeling wet. That's because you're about to cry. Cry? Okay, this is a toy store. Do you recognize it? Yes, this used to be my home. I want to leave. Hello, ladies. Could I help you find anything? Why does your friend look so scared? She's just like that. Do you have a doll that's like super realistic? Kind of seems like a human. Yeah, a little girl just stole her. Thank you for saying that to me. It really helped me understand. I'm sorry. I want to buy you, but I don't have any money. You don't need any money. You just need to carry me and run. You're pretty heavy. Thank you for getting me out of there. Now I'll show you where the best place to find me is. 
My high school. Okay, you show me the way and I'll carry you. Wait, before we go, I must ask. Won't your parents be worried about you? My parents won't be worried about me because I don't have any parents. I'm an orphan. I don't have any friends either. That's why I wanted a doll so bad, so I could have someone to play with and keep me company. I'll make you a deal. Once you get me back in my human body, I'll buy you as many dolls as you would like. Who are you looking at? My best friend Stephanie! And me! What are we going to do now? A little girl stole the real Brianna. Hey, look over there! That's me! Come on, hurry! Let's catch up to them! Brianna, wait! Stephanie! And me! Me when I was a doll. We found the real Brianna, but how are we going to get your body switched back? I have an option to go back as a doll, but I'm sorry, I can't do it. I don't want to go back to that toy store and that bad man. No, you have to give Brianna's body back. You're a doll, and she's a human. You can't steal her body. I have an idea. If you choose to go back as a doll, you can come back with me and be my doll. We'll be best friends. A friend? I've never had a friend before. Okay, I'll choose it. I'm back in my body. I'm back as a doll. Stephanie, I've missed you so much. I'm so excited to bring you home with me. Yes, you and I are going to have so much fun. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> what are these hearts on my face for, Mom? The hearts represent how many people must fall in love with you before you can meet your soulmate. When they fall in love, you lose a heart. What's the gold heart for? That represents your soulmate. You'll only lose the gold heart when your soulmate falls in love with you. <laughs> Hi, Jake. What do you want? I really like your left elbow. <laughs> what does that even mean? Get out of here. Oh no, what's wrong? I need five people to fall in love with me. Look at me. It's never going to happen. I'm a loser. You're not a loser. You're beautiful. You just need a makeover. Come with me. Who's that fine babe over there? Where? <laughs> He's talking about you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Don't snort. I, I think I'm in love with you. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. We should go on a date sometime. I'm sorry, Jake, but I don't think I'm your type. I'm Brianna. Who? The weird girl. <laughs> There's no way that's you. Goodbye, Jake. You're doing great. You already got someone to fall in love with you. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it great? I told you not to snort. I only need three more people to fall in love with me, and then I can meet my soulmate. Look, there's a guy right there. What do I do? Wink at him. Act cute. Play with your hair a bit. Whoa, is everything okay here, little man? Ah, uh, yeah, I'm okay. I was actually trying to flirt with you. <laughs> oh, you were? I thought there was something wrong with you. Hey, my name's Jason. What's yours? Brianna. We should exchange numbers. Okay. You lost another heart! No way, your makeover's working great! Hey, Bray. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Your makeover's working great! Hey, Bray. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Brianna, look at this insect I found. <laughs> wow, well, let me see. Brianna, tell him. Kevin, I'm sorry, but we can't be friends anymore. I'm trying to get boys to fall in love with me, so... I can't be seen with the weird guy. I really hope that getting boys and being popular is worth losing who you are. So after class, we'll go looking for the next guy. Brianna, don't wear your glasses. I can't see anything. Why do I have to change everything about myself to get boys to like me? Why can't I just be me? Brianna, wait. This is just so boys will fall in love with you so you can find your soulmate. Once you find your soulmate, you can go back to being yourself again. And who's to say my soulmate's going to love me for who I am? No one else does. Brianna, you lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. You lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. Hey, Brianna. Your grades have been doing phenomenal. You're looking really good these days. I like your new look. I'll see you in class. Do you think it was Mr. Stevens that fell in love with you? For his wife and kids sake? I hope it's not him. Okay, right in front of you, that's Chad. He's one of the hottest guys in the school. Go up to him and ask if he would like to attend Devin's party with you. Kevin's walking this way. So? Hi, Kevin. Don't talk to me. You're too cool for me, remember, Brianna? <laughs> Brianna, what are you doing? Go talk to Chad. Right. Chad.
Yeah. Hi, what's your name? I'm not sure we've met before. <laughs> Stop, please don't like it when you cry. I don't care. I don't care about Chad. I'm in love with Kevin. Is Kevin more important than your soulmate? He is. Then go to him. Kevin, I... Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> I love you, Cynthia. Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> I love you, Cynthia. How'd it go with Kevin? Did you tell him you like him? He likes someone else. Brianna, you lost your last heart. Someone else fell in love with you. Chad. No, it wasn't Chad. It was me. Oh? Not in a romantic way, in a platonic way. I fell for you and I saw that you stay true to yourself and know what you want. The only person left to fall in love with you is your soulmate. That means I'm going to find my soulmate anytime now. That's the girl I remember. <laughs> It's so great to be myself again. Hey, do you mind if I sit next to you? Uh, okay. Does anyone know the answer to this equation? 7,422. Girl who knows her math. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's you. What? Nothing. Congrats on finding your soulmate and getting him to fall in love with you. What's this? It's a list of all the people who fell in love with you before your soulmate. The third person on the list is Kevin. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not going to be by drowning. I'm going to pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! Oh, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time, and it picked one for me! What? It picked one for you? Apparently you only get three choices! I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again! I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. Hey, are you okay? No, no, I can't pick that. Maybe I should have accepted the first one that it gave me. What's the reason that it gave you? I can't even say it. If it's that bad, just trust your gut and decline it. But what if it gives me this one? If you decline it, it has to refresh your reason. Okay, I'll do
Under arrest? Under arrest for what? You have the wrong person. Does your reason say none? Um, yeah. Then we have the right person. Come on. Stay right here so we can start questioning. Okay. So, what did you do to be immortal forever? I didn't do anything. I just declined the options I got. Lying is only going to make this harder for both of us. I'm not lying. What did you do to hack into the system? I did not hack the system. I could barely log on to my computer correctly. Ugh, you're a stubborn one, aren't you? I'm not stubborn. I'm just trying to tell you the truth. Are you going to tell us what we need to know or not? I've been telling you the truth this whole time.
So, what did you do to be immortal forever? I didn't do anything. I just declined the options I got. Lying is only going to make this harder for both of us. I'm not lying. What did you do to hack into the system? I did not hack the system. I can barely log on to my computer correctly. Ugh, you're a stubborn one, aren't you? I'm not stubborn. I'm just trying to tell you the truth. Are you going to tell us what we need to know or not? I've been telling you the truth this whole time. This is ridiculous. Wait, guys, she is telling the truth. You took the wrong girl. Oh, then we have to wipe her memory. What? Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not going to be by drowning. I'm going to pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? Mm -hmm.